What is going on my Super Sandwiches? Ramsa here and today I got some Dragon Ball Super Spoils for you guys which means if you want nothing spoiled this is your one chance to leave. Just to kind of go over what I'm going to talk about without actually jumping to the spoils just quite yet. We have episode 54 and 53 the titles and uh, they're very interesting. So if you don't want that spoiled then this is your chance to leave right now and to those who do want to see what's going on with the story then stick around because we're going to start talking about it right now. As always, big shout out to Herms for these translations. If you want to follow him, I will link his Twitter and description below. And if you watch Dragon Ball Super live every Saturday and follow him, he actually translates everything that's happening, so it makes it a lot easier to understand the episode. So if you want to do that, again, his Twitter is in the description below. So just real quickly to review where we're at with the story right now, episode 51 is going to air the following weekend, this weekend actually, and on Saturday slash Sunday, we'll see episode 51, and it is titled, Feelings That Transcend Time, Trunks and Mind. Now, in the last episode preview, we did see that Maya was still alive, she was moving, and, uh, yeah, we'll find out exactly what happens this weekend, I guess, because I can't really make a theory around that, because we all thought that she was dead. Although, I will point out that I did call it, I felt like she just wasn't just quite dead yet, maybe she was knocked out, who knows, and, uh, I guess we'll get more details this weekend. Now, the weekend after this, this is one that I'm excited for, because Trunks, future Trunks, is going to meet Gohan. Yes, folks, he's going to meet Gohan. And just like in the last video where I talked about the episode tells, I want you guys to have the funniest quote that Trunks is going to say to Gohan. When Trunks sees Gohan, what is the first thing he's going to say? Just drop it down in the comments below. I feel like he's going to walk down and be like, what? You, nah, you're not the same one. There's no way or something. I don't know. If you want to have fun with this, just feel free to drop your best comment that Trunks is going to say to Gohan in the comment section below. But that is going to air next week. Now, this is where we get into the new stuff. Well, sort of the new stuff. Episode, uh, or on July 24th, there is no new episode. They're skipping it for whatever reason. But the following weekend, on July 31st, we have episode 53, and it is titled, Reveal Black's True Identity, now off to the Kaioshin Realm of Universe 10. Yes, folks, Universe 10, you heard that correctly. Looks like we are going into another universe, once again, that Toriyama has created for us. I mean, it's kind of a no-brainer. After Battle of the Gods ended, he did mention, or he, well, not he, but... Beerus and we did reveal that there is uh, 12 universes and it would only make sense to further go into these but it's cool to see we'll see another universe on episode 53 on July 31st the question is is number one what exactly is Black's true identity and two why the universe or why the Kaioshin realm of universe 10 why not universe 7 or whatever so is he from another universe I guess the only way to find out is to wait the only thing that sucks is that we have to wait especially long just because July 24th is not going to have a new episode so the theories are going to run rampant until then I'm still going to stick with the theory that you know black is some kind of like a Mikaioshin like a demon or something that has the ability to steal bodies and just kind of build like the sand Frankenstein for himself and that's basically what he is there for and I don't know what his beef is with everybody but uh, you know I guess we'll find out in episode 53 what the story is finally of black and how you got Goku's body and all that stuff so I know you guys are hyped, and if you're hyped for that, make sure you leave a like right below. Now, episode 54, this title is extremely interesting. Dragon Ball Super episode 54, Inheritors of Saiyan Blood, Trunks' Resolve. I don't even know what to say here, or what to talk about. Inheritors of Saiyan Blood, is that referring to Trunks inheriting the Saiyan Blood through, you know, Bulma and, and, uh, and Vegeta? Because obviously Vegeta's a Saiyan and Bulma's a human. Is, does that have something to do with that, or is Inheritors of Saiyan Blood to do something with Black? Like, this, the black get the same blood and create his body or something like that. I have no idea, honestly. And all I can really do for episode 54 is basically say, what do you guys think this actually means? Now, episode 54 is going to air on August 7th, which unfortunately it sounds like it's pretty far away. And with all the news with Super right now, the more awesome news we get and leaks, the more hype we get to wait, the more further away it seems. So, I guess in the comment section below, let me know your best thoughts on what you think is going to happen in episode 54 of Dragon Ball Super. So yeah, that is everything. Again, if you're hyped for Dragon Ball Super so far, if you're enjoying the series and new arc, make sure you leave a like ring below. And don't forget to check out my Dragon Ball Zimmer's 2 stuff as well, because there was a bomb drop last night, with a bunch of new formations uh, that I will link in the description below in regards to pre-order bonuses, as well as transformations with the Majin Rays. So if you want to find out about that in case you missed it, the link to that is in the description below. But yeah, anyway, so just a little quick video I want to toss out there with the news. Again, let me know your thoughts and everything I talked about. What is Trunks going to say to Gohan and all that good stuff. And I guess uh, enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you guys in the section below. Peace.